Yeah. I lost Seekrin when you saw a lot. She's still incorporeal, ever since Kratos set her free of her corrupted form. But she hasn't let that stop her from helping any way she can. The truth is, I owe her more than I can repay. Ah, I don't see it that way. When we freed her, she could speak of little else but her reverence for you. Seeing you yourself again would surely be payment enough. The oarsmen. A monument to conquerors. Made some lovely warships, though.
Tell me of this power Heimdall wields. He sees the future. More like he reads the person, sees their intention. My intent will be to kill him. Knowing that will be no advantage. Brother, this is no one to underestimate. Any move you make, he'll have seen it coming. If you must face him, we need something else. An edge. Humor me? Very well. We will ask the dwarves. Ah. The inevitable asking of the dwarves. Excuse me, sir. Could I have a moment of your time? Oh dear, oh dear. What's to be done? What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nithog has been slain. And as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realms. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say raising a handful of leaned worms will be a walk in the park. Well then, what else, friends? About Nithog, you should know. We had no choice. It was Odin's doing. Oh, I am very well aware indeed of the alleged All-Father's role in this tragedy. Sadly, there's no expecting him to clean up after himself. Not all gods showed the interest that you do in righting past wrongs. Now please, take the capture device and see if you can find our missing leaned worms. Until we meet again. Well, any questions before you travel on? They're back. They're back. Simmer down. I see them.
we'd left something behind. At your service. Whatever you need, I'll create. Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Very good. Gonna keep it spatter-free this time, right? Kratos? What can I make for you? Always a joy to work on these. I'll disinfect my tools. I have news. Oh, did the Norns tell you how to get Atreus back? Do we have a plan? The Norns say Atreus will be killed by Heimdall. The plan is to kill Heimdall first. Oh, wow. Okay, Heimdall. Let's see. Never loses. Sees everything coming. Unpopular at parties. This won't be easy. Whatever his advantages, I will overwhelm him with my own. That's the idea. You gotta overpopulate his senses, see? And I got just the thing in mind to help you do it. Sindri! Go get Dropnir. Dropnir? But we need it. Our supplies. Oh, we got plenty. And to spare. Even if we did, Dropnir's no weapon. Why would a... Oh. You mean we combine it with... That's right. And then when he... It'll go... Damn you, that's brilliant. Very well. I suppose there's nothing to do but... Go fetch Dropnir. Drop near. I bloody knew these two had nicked it. And Odin blamed me for it disappearing. They stole Drop near. We didn't steal nothing. We just ungifted what never should have been gifted in the first place. How will it help me kill Heimdall? Never you mind all that. It's a fucking surprise. We're artistes. But to even store Drop near, you'd need. You were saying. Now you intend to kill Heimdall. Violence cannot prevent violence, Kratos. I truly thought you understood that. No matter what you thought I understood, my son is in danger. You will not allow harm to come to him. about you. 
your son. We Enough! Need... Heimdall's a threat, not only to Atreus, but to everyone. He's Odin's left hand, and he carries the horde that begins Ragnarok. If we have the chance to eliminate him, we then should... it's just as likely a trap, because the bastard knows your intentions. Kratos, I've never seen anyone so much as lay a finger on him. Not one. Well, I gathered what's fit for gathering. How long will it take? We'll have to go to Svartalfheim to get the rest of the materials. Not to mention, we'll have to visit the lady. Oh. Whew. Whew. That's a relief. <laughs> Ow. Kratos, whenever you're ready. No idea what he's on about, brother. I wish you'd come with us, dear. I know you mean well with that. But, to be honest, I don't like who I became on our last adventure. I can't be around the violence that follows him. That follows you both. I'm sorry. I'm ready when you are. See out there. Ah, time to go see the lady. I'll take it from here. Oh no! This whole thing were my idea. I'll speak to the lady. I never get to speak to the lady. There are reasons for that. Brock. We'll go. What? No, no, no. I you have to. heard him. Quit your fret. I ain't gonna mess nothing up. What the? <sighs> no, you pimp shrimps. Think that'll keep us out? Well, think the fuck again. What was all that, then? Oh, just Sindri trying to hog all the glory. Same old shit. Not that. The gate. What's wrong with a bloody gate? Most likely someone in neither the Lear been making a fuckery of the works. Probably on account of all that incursioning you got up to. But don't worry, you little dangling head. Old Brock came prepared. I got ways in and out from the old days. Gates they'd never even think to look for, on account of being stupid. Brock, where are we? This here's your stop. Abandoned service tunnel, direct to the forge camp. I'll meet you up there. Go on. Brock. And he's gone. You sure he was the right pick for this, brother? I trust him. He speaks plain. And yet so powerfully. We may need to work together on this one. There. We keep cooperating, maybe someday it'll be Asgard in flames. That is not my goal. Doesn't mean it's not your destiny. 
What are you insinuating, Highness? Not a thing. Poor bugger. Why would he hide in here? He feared something in these tunnels more than he feared starving. Hardly seems rational. Fear seldom is. Guess we'll have to blast our way out. That barrel by the gate will do the same. So, a tunnel for liquor and explosives. Little on the nose for dwarven culture, isn't it? Ridiculing a culture you helped undermine. Classic Aesir. Oh, all right. I might have earned that one. Well, I can see why it's an abandoned service tunnel. Careful, brother. That looks flammable. <laughs> Fortuitous oil spill. Right flank! <laughs> <laughs> 
place. He can't talk to the lady. He mustn't. No. Do not ask again. But... Oh, dear. It's not his fault Atreus ran off here. You know. Or are you just being Brock's champion? There it is again! You're insinuating, and you know it. Can't the smartest man alive put it together? The giants conceal a mysterious figure who changes the fate of Ragnarok, and you're oblivious to the only rational candidate. The one who's fought wars against gods and won. I am not their champion. Well, we're each entitled to our opinion. Gates seem to be connected. See if you can break that far fixture. <laughs> the sigil arrows should work with ice as well.
Sigil arrows won't work on this. <laughs> <laughs> 